All right, welcome to IS3 Podcast. I'm Scribble. I'm here with Cooper. And uh, I think Lopez is going to be joining us pretty soon and possibly Mita. Uh, it's been a while, man. I think our last, when was our last podcast? Had been like, what, September? A few months ago. It's It's it been a, a minute. Lot. So the funny thing is, is that as much as I've been wanting to do these podcasts, the we I I honestly haven't even turned on my computer in almost three months. So like I, I turned it on like a week ago and I just logged in like into Windows like yesterday. And I yeah. and I haven't even had it on in two or three months. But, honestly, uh, I could have this for a little bit too. I came I, back. Oh yeah. I got in um the what was I gonna say? Uh in uh I keep getting all these notifications that I'm paying for our podcast service and we're not even podcasting. So I'm, I think I paid quite a bit. Actually, I paid over 30 bucks over the, in the last few months for something we're not even using. <laughs> but anyway, it's back up. So I'm hoping we can start podcasting some more. So it's been a few months, man. How you been? Uh, I, mean, I got supervisor. That's one thing that got me pretty happy. But other than that, everything's been good. My life is going steady again. How about you? Well, how long? How long has it taken you now to get pot, to get supervisor? <laughs> We're not going to talk about that one. <laughs> Why not? But we should talk about your uh, two year <laughs> supervisor app. A year and a, was a year and a half, two years. It's been a while. It's it's been a good time because you know I have to keep on waiting for people to leave or step down and all that, and actually try to get to the interview stage and pass the interview. Well, uh. You know what they say is that when they when they dig at the bottom of the barrel, they got to find somebody. Mm, you're right. <laughs> I guess it was right. your turn. <laughs> uh, hey, your okay, turn to the bottom okay. of the barrel. Yeah, okay, okay, calm down. Now. <laughs> so, uh, gotta, yeah, I'm, I'm actually, I started doing DoorDash, believe it or DoorDash. not. DoorDash. It's, it's actually. You need the of the bag? Shh, we don't talk about <laughs> it. <okay? laughs> no, um. No, I, it's actually a lot of fun. I love driving. So I love driving. And I love meeting people. So it's both best of both worlds, I guess. The only problem is I live in, well, my town that I live in doesn't even do it. So I have to go 15 miles to the next town before I can even get inside the little map that lets you do DoorDash. And so in, I'm an hour away from Austin. Austin's the big one. So if I went there, I could easily make tons of money. But yeah. it's an hour and a half drive just to get to Austin for me. And then, so I, I just go 20 miles away to a small town. It's it's not enough to, it doesn't, I don't make enough to pay the bills doing that, but I have enough that I can just have spending money. So, but it's it's always just, a, it's always just a hit and miss on it. It's a nice little side job on this side to make some extra cash when you need. Pretty and much. So you like it too. Oh, so, yeah. I mean, that's, that's also a big plus for it. Yeah, dude, I, I put on so many miles of my car doing that. But uh, it's uh, I got, I actually have some pretty funny stories from. Well, I've been doing it for about two months now, uh, almost every day. Um, this week actually kind of sucked because we had Christmas and everything. So, the way it goes is that it goes from you work or the pay periods go from Monday to Sunday. And then they do a direct deposit on Monday, and it clears on Tuesday. So you you really get paid on Tuesday. Um, but I, I've done 170 deliveries in two months, which is pretty awesome. It's and I have, bad, and it's on a five it's on a five star scale rating system, and I have like 4.7 on customer service, believe it or not. Uh, and then I have 100% on acceptance and completing ratio. And then I have a uh, 90, I think it's 94, 95% on delivering on time or early. What it is? What's hey, up? Hey, what's, what's up, Lopez? Up? Hey, we're just I'm starting, on. We just started a podcast, man. We're talking about that I've been doing DoorDash. Oh, that's what's up, man. I use DoorDash. You use it or you drive it? <laughs> I use it. Like, I can order shit from it. Nice. You're going to catch Scribble eating the fries from the bottom <laughs> of your back. If, if I Fucking ever get it. your order, you're going to get half a burger, to be honest. <laughs> I'll let you eat half of it as a contributor. <laughs> you're not getting a tip. 
<laughs> well, you I tipped mean, half of the burger. I mean, I mean, the uh, food's a pretty good tip, to be honest. Oh, you, so... you can't go wrong with the food. <laughs> it's it actually food. Uh, there's actually a few places that I've delivered multiple. Like uh, there's these guys way out in the boonies, and I deliver to them almost every single day, and they always get Subway. And then the other day they ordered chilies. Like I saw, you're like name. yes, finally something new. <laughs> <laughs> no, I saw the name, and when I delivered it to him, like I'm like, am I at the right place? Because this isn't Subway, and he just laughs, like yeah, we figured I'd switch it up this time. Yeah, <laughs> right now <laughs> I'm live streaming because I was live streaming when I was on medic. Oh uh, yeah, so you're gonna live yeah, stream so. our podcast? You change your title to our <laughs> podcast. Uh, what's the podcast name? I'll name it. I just name it. You're a co-caster. You don't know the podcast name. The IS3 podcast. What yeah, God. Nerd. Sorry, I'll change it now. <laughs> Damn. I'm gonna I just said chatting, game. chilling with Scribbles. Ask Scribbles. <laughs> so, okay, nah. so here's one of the funny stories from whenever I first started. Uh, the, I, I didn't really know how it worked. It, when you start up, it really doesn't give you an explanation or it doesn't really explain how to do things and uh-huh. the town I'm in the every single first off the town I'm the town I door dash in there's absolutely zero streetlights not a single streetlight in the whole city so it's dark yeah it's dark as hell in there uh, uh-huh like I'll, I'll be going down like the main roads with my brights on so I can see shit like that's how dark it is yeah. That's fucking wild. <laughs> yeah, it's so dark. So you can't, and you can't see the house numbers that way. And secondly, the house numbers are random. Like sometimes they'll be on the door, sometimes they'll be like above the garage, sometimes the sometimes they'll be on the mailbox, sometimes they'll be on the bricks around the mailbox. And since it's so dark, you can't even see them. So Damn. So the way door like I use Apple Maps for my DoorDash and uh-huh. it gives just a vicinity like if it goes to an apartment complex it gives a vicinity it, like it takes you to the complex not the actual which building it is and some of these buildings out here or some of these complexes there's like 18 buildings and uh okay. like uh there's one that the address well, to give an example the address is like 2207 uh-huh so I have to go f- and so I'm looking for address 2207, which doesn't make any sense because none of the addresses are 2207. But the way the address actually is set up, it's building 22, door 7. But it puts it all together for the address, so it's it's super confusing out here. And none of them go in order. Like, like if you go in the order of the complex, it'll be like 1, 8, two, three, 12. I'm like, so you're looking around everywhere and then people complain, like, why couldn't you find my place? It's like, because it, the numbers don't make any sense. That's why I couldn't find it. So, yeah. But uh, one time when I was this lady, like school just got out for elementary and like how I knew that is like. Your girlfriend got out of school? Oh, yeah, shut the fuck up. <laughs> but no, um, uh, uh, the elementary bus came in my neighborhood because I live in a big neighborhood. So, uh, so you're talking about little kids, okay? Fuck <laughs> off. But no, uh, so like I ordered DoorDash and this bitch legit took like nearly an, an hour. It took an hour and 30 minutes just to get my shit and like just to come to me and like. You know, there's like a little app that you can see where they're like on right. the DoorDash. You can see where they're at. Yeah. Well, legit, this bitch is just sitting there for a like good fucking like hour and thirty minutes, and like then at like your house or like at the spot or what? Where was she sitting? Uh, wherever she was standing, like at like she already picked up my food and shit. So like, say, so, you, ordered, say you ordered McDonald's, she's just sitting at McDonald's for an hour and a half. No, she picked it up and then just sat, just sat and just waited. Like she drove off. You can say like just picked up your orders, like heading your way, and then like she just like sat. I'm like, what the fuck's going on? And I'm like, I'm like, you know, you can message them too. So like I fucking a message, and I'm like, when is my food getting here? She's like, it'll be here. I'll get there shortly. I'm like, okay. And then like as you watch her like, sit there. 
Yeah, I'm like, I, I like at the time, like I'm like nearly, I'm like getting ready for work, and then this bitch is not still coming. Like she's not there. I'm like, what the fuck is going on? I'm like, and then like when she pulls up, like to drop it off. Cause she's like arrived here, whatever it says, and she fucking like all I see, she left her like driver's door open, and she has a like a little girl in the passenger seat with her book bag on. I'm like, well, that fucking explains. You're just waiting for your child and shit. That's you know. dumb. Yeah, I'm like, okay. Uh, we I just like um, before you jumped in here, we were actually going over my ratings. And I'm actually gonna pull it up so I can give you an exact. Fuck number. your ratings! Fuck I'm joking. Your ratings, man. The ratings are pretty shit. He has like a one star. In there. <laughs> exactly, yeah, one star. Now that my customer service rating is four point eight three out of five. Acceptance That's rate fun, is one hundred percent. Completion rate is one hundred percent. On uh, time, of course, it needs to be fucking completed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, on time or early is ninety four percent. And I've done 174 uh, deliveries. I need you as my fucking door dash. I, I will say one time I tipped <coughs> this dude fucking like $5. Because like this dude was like fucking like, I'll be there. Like, you know, dude, like I definitely knew he was fucking speeding. But like, I didn't like the dude. Like he like it was like late at night too. So like it was really late one night and shit. And like I ordered me like a baconator fries from Wendy's and shit. So then like. One night he did, like, he got it, and then the next night I was fucking, like, I want fucking baconated fries again. That shit's great. And then, like, I ordered it again, and it was him. He's like, I knew it was you. I was like, yeah, man, it's, I, I like them. He's like, can't get you wrong, man. I had them myself in the past, and it's good. And I'm like, yeah. And shit. So. I actually, I don't order food from there. I only have, because there's three apps. There's the DoorDash customer app where like you order your food and does all that then there's a dasher yeah. app which is what i have and it tells you like where you can pick stuff up and everything and then there's the merchant app which is all the restaurants how, that, how does that work like my i'm confused like how does it work like does it like mean, like the dasher like, app? how do you, you know how do you like do you pay for it or like does it like instantly send money to you like that that app and then you pay through it or like um or just like, like if, do they have like I, a computer? You mean if I have to pay for the food? No, like how do you, how does a paying transaction work? Because like I don't even know. Uh, well, whenever you sign up, like you you have DoorDash, so like whenever you sign up for yeah, it, no, no, credit no. card info. So yeah, no, no, like, it. but like, do you just go there and pick it up and like that's all? Yeah. Like yeah, just oh. um, some some places. I didn't know that you know. Yeah, some some places thought, like, require you to pay, but. It actually it takes your money out. We have uh, we have these business credit cards that mm -hmm. it, um, it's pretty much like an escrow account. And um, you know what an escrow account is? No, I don't. It's where it's where two parties have access to an account, and you can um, you both can put in and take out money out of that account. So all these uh. all these business cards we have are, are like escrow accounts. They're, that's not what they are, but they're like that. And so, like, say you order, say you order McDonald's. Uh, so you, you order $16 of McDonald's and it includes your tip and everything. So that $16 comes out of your account into this escrow account. And that I get the notification, hey, dumb shit wants a, wants a burger from McDonald's. So I hit accept and I go to McDonald's and I say that I'm arrived uh, and I pick up your burgers and, or say, say I had to pay for it there. So I take the I take my business card that's like an escrow account that has your money in it that you've already paid. I swipe it, mm -hmm. and then it takes the money out of the escrow account that I have access to spend, and you have access to the deposit. And then mm -hmm. I pick then I pick up your food. I I actually mark what I picked up, and then uh, say I picked it up, and then it gives me directions to your house, and then I drive to your house and mark that I've arrived, and then give you your food. Then I mark that it's complete, and then I get another order and rinse and repeat. That shit seems pretty fucking boring. It's actually not. And the cool thing is that I live, or the town that I do it in, it's a small town. So um, it actually covers one, two, three. It, co it covers four small cities. Or I got, they're not even cities. They're four small towns. But if I were to only be in, if I was to only be in the town, 
um, my from one end of the town to the other is like five miles. Maybe it might oh. might be seven miles. Um, now I I heard that you already get paid when you do it. Like, does tipping just add on more? Because like at times, like I feel like tipping is like three dollars and like you usually can get like you know i don't know like my mom usually tips like occasionally she uses it once does in she, a blue moon does she tip cash or in the app in the app um yeah and, and actually but um, like just say if i just say if i don't tip you do you already still get, you get paid then you're gonna get some shitty fucking service well <laughs> i oh, when it says to my shit that like for the delivery drive is like fucking four ninety nine. So do you already get paid just to drive? Yeah. And just um, do it's, it? It's uh it's not exact, but it's based kind of off of mileage. And um everything's done off of mileage, like your your drive time and your pay and everything. So um and I I don't know if you guys because I don't have the the actual consumer app, so I don't know if I add that if you're supposed to add the tip to it or if it comes out of the drive, but um, yeah, because it says like delivery drive is like fucking this amount of money, and then like that's why I'm like, do I really want to tip them if they're already getting paid? Like just save like 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 four ninety nine or like five ninety nine because you're already getting paid good right there. Like I'll like the most I'll tip is like three dollars. Like I'll just tip you like a, like two dollars. Yeah, because like. Um, they, like my you, meal's already fucking expensive. And yeah, I can go get my like if I really want to go get a monthly myself. fee. Um, I don't pay monthly fee. I don't. don't. Um, no, that's yeah, that's that's, a, that's like an add on. Like you get like free deliveries and some shit. Uh, yeah, that um. Yeah. Some some people have tips included and some don't. Um, there's a couple people that will include a tip on the app and then they'll also give you cash. Yeah. So so that's pretty nice. Uh, I actually got a, the other day, um, I got a $20 tip right before Christmas. That's what's uh, up, man. So someone, I, it, I I was actually only going like three blocks from the food place to their house. It was like three blocks. And so they gave me a $20 tip and it was like, Merry Christmas. Like, oh, wow. Thank you. Yeah. That's that's what's up. I give them $40 tips. It depends on the person. Like one time this game was I'm like during Christmas. I think it was like a year ago. Hot. <laughs> I'm gonna come deliver to you then for a forty dollar tip. Hell yeah, man! It, it did like <laughs> uh, it was like um, I think it was like two days after Christmas. This was last year. It was like I think it was like the twenty sixth or twenty seventh of December, and like I was fucking hungry, so I wanted a, like a gyro and shit. So I had him bring it to me, and then like you just he, call like, it like, his gyro? car was so it's jacked. A gyro. Up. Yeah, same thing. I don't go fuck. I call him gyro. Fuck off. But like his car was all <laughs> fucked up and shit. So I felt like really bad. I was like, damn, he has a fucked up car. And he's out here doing this. I was like, fuck it. Give him $40, $40. He's like, did you mean to give me like 20 or something? I was like, nah, 40 bucks. He enjoy. He's like, thanks, man. Like, Don't he come like to deliver to your house, man. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> I'm good big tips sometimes. Like, if I, like, if you do Dude, good or if like. I, if I can get half a burger and like, a $40 nah, tip. On the app, this is ASAP. <laughs> if it's like ASAP, like you're fucking there. Like, because occasionally from the distance from like the closest like fucking restaurant like there's a mcdonald's legit up the road which doordash doesn't go for i don't know why but like if they go like if like one time like they ordered me like i ordered me i hops and some pancakes and shit and the person like like you know on the app you can say like asap i'm like okay cool like asap you know like, be there as like soon as possible and fucking Dude took like fucking because it's like maybe a twenty minute drive. I don't know how the dude made it in like ten minutes. Like this fuck, you're like speed. Well, you said like, you wanted like, ASAP, so he gave it to you ASAP. <laughs> yeah, I always do ASAP, but it keeps the most. It occasionally takes like twenty minutes because the drive and the meal and shit. I actually had somebody get mad at me uh, the other day because uh, apparently they're waiting for like forty five minutes, but I I turned off my app so I could eat dinner. Uh, because when you can go on pause, but it only gives you like thirty minutes, so I'm like, thirty minutes isn't enough to like sit down, order, wait for the food to cook, get it out, and eat. Like that's not enough time. So I just yeah. I, I was in my dash, and then yeah, when I turned it back on, I immediately got an order, and um, so I accepted the order, and then thirty seconds after I accepted it, I get a text from the customers like, "Are you at this place yet?" I'm like, 
no, I just got the order like 30 seconds ago. She's like, well, I've been waiting for like 45 minutes. I'm like, my delivery time is in like almost 30 minutes. Like, what do you mean? Yeah. So, like, I just got it. She's like, well, I'm just going to cancel it. I'm like, okay, whatever. No, like, one, st- the one time get paid. When I If they cancel, it. I still get paid, so. One time when I got it from DoorDash, this fucking, this person, like, kept on calling me. I'm like, I already placed my order, and this is exactly how I want it. And he kept fucking calling me because, like, I, like, I don't know. Like, he just didn't, like, know how to use it right or some shit. And I'm like, what the fuck, dude? Like, he's like, so did you order this? I'm like, yes, I ordered that. I'm like, did you get this? I'm like, yes, I got that. And, like, he just made, like, I'm like, what the fuck are you calling me for? He must have been new, like, super new. Because it, it legit tells you exactly what you are getting. Yeah. So, yeah, he must have been super new. Or I don't know. illiterate. I don't know. But uh yeah, so Both. far I've <laughs> I've been doing it for about 2 months and um I only, Is I only it, do does it, it for, pay good cuz like when every time I use DoorDash is when I use DoorDash I never money. see the same people besides that one dude when I got the baconator fries. Uh you well you live in a big you live in California, don't you? No, I live in fucking Virginia, but yeah, like Yeah, was close. California? <laughs> <laughs> that was close. That's uh, not, this, this bitch on the West Coast. That was the East Coast, bitch. Um, like, you should have seen my face. I'm like, the fuck? <laughs> Are you stupid? Um, well, my town, there's actually, there's only like four dashers in the town that I dash in. Uh, uh-huh. so, and, they're, and they usually go over to Austin most of the time. So it's usually uh-huh. only, it's only like me and maybe another person. Um, yeah. but like I said, it's a small town. It's like seven miles by five miles. It's small. Um, yeah. so if I, if I were to go That's to Austin, small. yeah, if I were to go to Austin, I'd make, I'd make bank, but Austin's like an hour and a half drive for me. Nah, so, it's not worth it then. um, but the town, I, the town I go in, I make roughly about $40 a night, but I only dash from like four thirty at night to seven thirty. So I only do it for three hours. Uh, so like make, for me, I can't for like I usually so making never forty get, bucks in three hours is pretty good. I usually they I never could dash uh like late at night like I never can like after like ten o'clock a lot of the restaurants and shit closes yeah. so like I can just never um you know get what I kind of want. I, I can probably see if I can get IHOP, but it usually just doesn't let me. But I usually don't like want to order something that late at night because I don't know who the fuck's gonna pull up. I actually ran into and a I- problem like that. Um, why? Um, one of my delivers I actually had to call in and cancel it, and then have it have it credited back to me because I because you know my ratings are high and I want to keep them that way. So somebody uh-huh. ordered from somebody ordered from a sports bar. It was like nine thirty at night, super early on a weekend, so the bar was busy, and. So they order all the, they order this food and I get to the bar and they're like, oh, we closed our grill because it was slow. Like, what do you mean you closed your grill? Like, it's nine o'clock on a weekend. So I had to call the customer, tell them that they that they closed their grill as early, and then I had to after I called him, he got a refund from DoorDash and I had to call DoorDash and tell them that the com- the restaurant closed their grill, and. Um, I had to go get all my, I had to do my stuff to get, I had to get paid for one because I already accepted it. And then two, the, I, I had to make sure my ratings were up because since it was accepted, but not completed, they it would fuck up my ratings. Uh-huh. So, so I had to have them do all their stuff. So to get wh- it going. no, now you kind of say that one time I ordered Panera and just hear me out, like off of Uber Eat and I canceled I it because I'm like, fuck it. Eats. Yeah, but no, like, I canceled it, and I still got the food, and I got all my money back from it, so I basically got me fucking free Panera, dude. Sounds like you need to pay, door, pay Uber Eats some money. Fuck that, man. <laughs> that, but no, now, now you kind of say, like, I don't know this is fucking random, but me and my brother on, like, fucking Christmas uh, Eve and shit, we... No, it was Christmas Day, and, like, we're coming home to eat, like, some food and shit, you know, eat up, you know, everything, and... <laughs> it's usually what you do we with were... food? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> we got some food, and then we, <laughs> no. like, ate it, you know? Yeah, well, I'm I'm common with that. 
Like I understand it. <laughs> anyway, so but we so we pulled up. So I live in a really big like neighborhood, and not trying to say anything is a big fucking like rich neighborhood. Not trying and, to flex, but you know I'm rich. You know. No, I don't <laughs> like that. I don't like doing shit like that. Only when it comes to shoes. When it comes I'm, to shoes, I'm not trying to flex. But I'm rich, you peasants. I never <laughs> called you peasant, but no, no, no. Um, I, me, and my brother like pulled up, and we went through the back of the neighborhood. There's like three entrances: there's a front, and there's a side, and there's a back. And we went through the back. And Always enter through the rear. It, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Is Cooper no, still it was. Here? No, nah, like, it was really fucking weird because we pulled up to, like, the south side and there's a dude, like, never seen in the neighborhood. Uh, he just, like, you know how you kind of, like, nod your head or kind of, like, put your hand up to show, like, as, like, right. hey, like, you give them, like, you know, to be, like, hey. like yeah. yeah, like, a nice gesture or some shit. Right. And, like, the dude, like, the stared at us. We're like, what the fuck? And my brother's like, does that dude live in your neighborhood? I'm like, i never seen him. Like, no, like, I've never seen the dude. And okay. then we, like, the, like right like right next to his, uh, our, where, like, we park and shit. So we just took a right, and then we kind of drove up a little bit and took another right. And we went to park, and this dude, like, right behind us, because, like, there's a little pathway near the, like, there's, like, a sidewalk near, like, right at the south side. And the dude, like, that dude did a 180 and just, like, walked out like behind our car but not like really close it was maybe like i say like four feet away from us like three did it like he was lost or what i no, the dude was on something dude like <laughs> i couldn't tell you like he just like he came up right behind like me and my brother got out of the car and he got he was like maybe like uh, like two feet away from us like maybe like nearly like a one feet away from us from like the back of the car and shit and we're already like walking towards like my house and where like we parked there's like bushes and we're already like walking like past the bush and we got like on the sidewalk and shit and the dude's like hey and we're like my brother's like what's up like like stern and i was like what the fuck is wrong with that dude like he just like legit like basically like was like instantly behind us i'm like what the hell is this dude doing like I thought I was about to get jumped right in front of my house, but, like, my brother is, like, me and my brother looked at each other, like, if this dude tries anything, he's about to get his ass beat, like, it was fucking scary, man, like, and, like, I went in the house, and, like, my mom and my grandpa and my, like, uh, dad, my stepdad was like, what's up? And we're like, hey, how did this everything this go? This went from an Uber Eats story to, like, getting jumped. <laughs> you, nah, I, I said this is random as fuck, so you can't say shit. <laughs> I Did guess. you say your dad and your stepdad? No, I meant, I meant to say my stepdad. I am about to say, well, well, there's something not right going on in the house. What's happening there? It's kind of like you and your uncle, or you and your aunt, I guess. All right, all right. <laughs> oh, Cooper got to say something. <laughs> but not like, like, Cooper the dude, actually like. Cooper actually sent me a picture of his aunt. And, uh, she, she cute? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Uh, Shaq is like, now oh, I yeah. Why, now I know why he likes her so much. You know what I mean? <laughs> I think there's no fucking around. But nah, like, I mean, I've never seen, like, I, mean, I think the dude was on something, but he didn't look like he was on something. He like he was, like, trying to do something. I don't know. So he was on some, but he didn't look like he was on some, and he wasn't on some, so, but he looked like he was on some. <laughs> yeah, that's, totally. that's, that's exactly what you just said. <laughs> Nah, but I said he was like, he just looked like he was trying to do something, you know? Yeah. Like, and, not not gonna lie, Cooper's aunt's the hottest girl out of three people in their town. Uh, 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 three people. <laughs> I'm gonna fucking neck myself. <laughs> so, well, 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 so you did have something with your aunt, dog. <laughs> so, another another DoorDash story. They, a lot of people forget where they live. Honestly, it's kind of funny. And the uh, fuck? yeah, so there's one you order. to some old ass people, then, dog. No, these are like middle aged people. But uh, old ass people. When I, when I first started dashing, somebody wanted me, where was I think it was, they wanted me to pick up an order from Chili's. Yeah. And then welcome take to Chili's. Yeah. And they do it every time I walk in. Hi, welcome to Chili's. 
But um, um, they they actually uh, they actually know me well enough now that they know I'm a dasher. So, um, but uh, fuck is Scribble getting famous out here for door right, dashing? Man. Celebrity fuck, status, like, like popping out like your podcast dog. <laughs> I'm actually gonna get uh, yeah. uh, YouTube and podcast do business cards made. Podcast. I don't. I don't want to brag, but you know, I got a podcast that goes out to about four people. You know, you got a fucking flex. <laughs> uh-huh. It's like it's like I don't, I don't want to flex, but you know, I got a podcast that goes out to at least three people. Yeah, right up. Please. So, <laughs> yeah. So, um, but anyway, so I, I do a pickup. Says, "Hey, go pick up a Chili's. You need this, this, and this." I'm like, "All right." So I go pick it up, and I, um, do the directions for delivery. Takes me to McDonald's. I'm like, all right. So I go to McDonald's and I'm like, is so-and-so here? They're like, no. I'm like, all right, well, uh, they ordered DoorDash and they want it delivered here. And so I called the customer and she's like, oh, um, I was there earlier for some reason and it made the, made me go, made it my, my delivery address. Can you deliver it to here? I'm like, I guess. So... So apparently she forgot where she lived. She thought I guess she thought she lived at McDonald's. I don't know. Nice. That's yeah. hot, man. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah, I live at McDonald's. <laughs> yeah, I actually get um I actually get some free stuff from McDonald's almost every day. Uh Shut I don't the fuck up, man. Stop flexing, dude. You're hurting my heart, <laughs> man. You're dude, flexing so hard on me. Yeah, dude. Like I'm I'm gonna flex so hard, you know, like I get like I got a podcast that goes out to three people. I got a YouTube channel that gets at least one view a day. That uh, you know, I get free stuff from McDonald's. Flex the hard over here, man. You're flexing too hard, <laughs> bro. Now that uh, can you change I, it up from DoorDash because I'm tired of DoorDash now. <laughs> I want this podcast being all DoorDash. I mean, Shit. it's it's about to be all DoorDash. We've been talking about DoorDash for thirty minutes. Fuck your DoorDash now. Let's. <laughs> switch it up so uh, how's your aunt doing cooper <laughs> yeah it, <laughs> i was talking to them little kids that come home from the elementary school Lope. <laughs> yeah hey, Lope, how's, how's your girlfriend that gives off the elementary school bus shut the fuck up with your door dash fucking females that forget where they live hey at least, he's more, at least he's talking more females than you not gonna lie though like at least i ain't fucking my aunt I got I'm getting him. pussy. At least I'm getting pussy. Whoa, 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 whoa. You're fucking hey, odd. Calm down, okay? <laughs> hey, not gonna lie though, that while I'm while I'm door dashing, like there's so many girls that I've been hitting up. Oh yeah, so many girls screaming. <laughs> I can't already see how it goes up to a baby girl. No, I just wake so some fucking lips on you. I walk I walk up to him like, like oh I'm Hey baby. <laughs> I walk up to him like, hey girl, I'm making so a few bucks off of this. <laughs> Dude, he has his number on a napkin that's inside the fucking bag and shit. Just like, here you go. It's a paper towel. Some, some Excuse me, it's a paper towel. I'm, okay. <laughs> he just wings out like, I left a little something special in there for you, baby. Yeah, I blew this my nose. This is fucking saliva, dude. I, <laughs> I blew my nose. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> well, imagine going down, grabbing your food, and you just grab a fucking snot rocket ass. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, so moving off of DoorDash, how was your guys' Christmas? Did you guys fucking great, dude? Got a hundred dollars, and he got with his aunt dog. Dude, that's a that's a win for win right there. Honestly, she paid me the hundred dollars because it was a little you like, little um, prostitute, you. <laughs> <laughs> you dirty whore! You dirty, <laughs> dirty <laughs> whore! It was that she was actually behind payments for the last 10 times yeah paid it, paid it in full <laughs> yeah, about 10 bucks for each day you know? but nah uh my show was pretty great how about De- yours scribbles? it was decent that uh i was actually like i'm super hard to shop for so i've been i've been making an amazon list all year and it's it's actually it's all camera stuff cam- camera equipment yeah, and uh, I was fucking. I messaged you on fucking uh, Snap, and like it was like, oh yeah, I don't know what it was. It was a little kid, and I'm like, that looks like. Oh you. yeah, yeah. It's like Merry Christmas, motherfuckers. Awesome. Well, that. It was a yeah. kid that was like, like, and you talk about my shit. Who was it though? 
Yeah, who was it? I don't know. I got that sent to me like three years ago, and I've kept it, and I oh, sent it out. I, I sent it out to people like, every oh, year. Oh, Chris Scribble's keeping. Oh, yeah, what you doing? Kids? Oh, what the fuck? Oh, whoa, whoa, yeah, hey. what the fuck? So I send it out every year for Christmas to people. <laughs> oh, what the Holy fuck? Christmas. Okay. What the fuck? Yeah, it's funny. You fucked fight. up. You're done. Like, at first, I thought it was your kid, but then I was like, you know, like, not your kid. Scribble like, thought, is not going to have a kid. I don't dude. see him having a kid. He's like, I have two kids. I thought, like, you're like your friend. You think a little kid is his fucking friend, dude? That's pretty sketchy. Oh, I, have, I, said, I already have two kids, nerd. I, oh, you yeah, I forgot. Kid? You actually do have here, kids. Here it is. This, this is it right here. I was fucking. I don't want to see your fucking kids, Scribble. Who the fuck you think I am? God damn, you stupid. <laughs> Merry Christmas, motherfuckers! That's great, no, that's Motherfuckers! Sounds like an Irish mob surgery. Sounds like an Irish mob surgery. Merry Christmas, motherfuckers! So here's here's the thing. Like I I sent my mom, like my mom's the only family I have down here, and Mm -hmm. uh, so I I sent I sent her that list that I made um, every week throughout December, Uh, part of Mm -hmm. part of November too. And then I go to her house Christmas Day, and guess what I get? Fifty dollar gift card. I'm like I've been sending you, I've been sending you this list all week, like, or for the last month. And so what I did is I took that fifty dollar gift card. It's your home. mom, bro. She's getting all nah. dogs. She don't know how to use. No, it. she's they they only do fifty dollar gifts, um, because there's so many people they gotta buy for. So they got understandable. Yeah, she's got me, both my kids. Um, I think she buys yes. stuff for my ex. I don't know. I don't know if she does or not. Um, they got her husband's two kids, and then I think they have one. Two, I think they have three kids on their side, maybe four. Damn, so, sound like some busy fucking people. So yeah, well, there's you know. So yeah, 50, that you know that in itself is like four hundred bucks, five hundred bucks. Damn, this was up. I'm not gonna lie, when I heard that little kid going like, hey, Merry Christmas, motherfuckers, I think of that one scene from uh, Home Alone. Oh, yeah. Or is that Merry, Merry Christmas, Christmas, you filthy, filthy animal. animal. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's what uh, I think of. I think of that guy. Yeah, so, so what I did is that I actually took that $50 gift card and I went through my own list and I bought um, I bought four things. 50 bucks. Um, it was actually 40, it was actually ended up being forty nine eighty seven. So, for what? Uh, I got, uh, I got a, a mount that goes on the camera. Um, I'm pulling it up now. I got a, It's a three suction cup mount that goes on your car. Um, and then you can. It has the little screw on it, so you can screw your camera onto it, and it all attached to windows and dashboards and everything. So it's just a mount, so I can vlog in the car. And then I got a um, an egg timer for my camera, and you, you know what an egg timer is? It's for the kitchen. You set it and it counts down, tick 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 tick. And you, go, you know what that is? All right, Hello? guess not. Guess not. So I got this one for a camera, and what it does, it rotates 360, 360 degrees, and what it's for is for a time lapse. So you set your camera on time lapse, and then you set. Um, you set the egg timer for however long your time lapse is, and it'll rotate your camera automatically. Uh, so, like, say you do a sixty-minute time or a sixty-minute time lapse, it'll end up being like sixteen seconds long. So, you set the egg, you set the egg timer for sixty minutes, and then it'll Hello? rotate your camera, um, however however much you want to adjust it for sixty minutes. And then when you get your time lapse, you get a good pan. God damn. Uh, and then I bought this uh, mount that goes on top of your ca- it mounts to your camera, and then you can attach other things to it, like a light and microphone, monitor, just extra stuff. Mm-hmm. Um, so I got that, and then I bought a light. So I bought a light, so now I can film in the dark. <gasps> you know what that's for, right? Yeah, all I hear is a lot of mounting and shit. Yeah, it's a, pretty much what it is. Porn shoot. <laughs> yeah. That's right. That's right. Oh, speaking of porn shoot. Oh, actually, no. 
I actually have, it's not a porn shoot, but uh, a friend of mine that I actually befriended doing DoorDash at McDonald's, that she's pregnant, and I'm actually shooting her maternity photos in about a week, a little more than a week. You fucking uh, dirty bitch. <laughs> no, um, so she, she just she just went into her third trimester, and so I I told her, like, I need to practice photography on people because I, I only do it on, like, in, inanimate objects like trees and sceneries and stuff like that. And so I'm I, an inanimate object. It's right, you are. So I don't, I don't know how to... I'm not very good at shooting people, you know. That's why I've never been to a school. Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, same. <laughs> now that uh, so so, so I need to I need to practice on people, and usually it's like two to four hundred dollars for a shoot like that. Uh, and I told him I'd do it for free because they get they get photos and I get to practice. So. So yeah, we're doing that in a little more than a week. Actually, about nine days is when we're doing it. So that'll be that'll be a fun experience. You fucking weirdo! You're weird, scribbles. Why? Because I have a hobby other than playing video games. Shut the fuck and up! You play video games too. Do you legit? This is the first time my computer's been on in almost three months. Why you want a fucking cookie? I uh, I would like two of them, please. <laughs> fuck no! You <laughs> Yeah, can I have Cooper, three? you're a fucking ginger and also no one gets cookies. <laughs> Are you Cooper, doxing me? <laughs> Cooper, we give you an inch and you take all eight. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> all right, well. Yeah, I'm a little greedy. <laughs> greedy bastard. <laughs> <laughs> all right, well, we're hitting about our 45-minute marker. That went by pretty quick. Uh, uh, anything anybody want to close out with or add to the end of our podcast? I love dick. Wait. Very all right. Special to- uh, medic's going great. That's all, really. Senior R.R. Cooper finally made it. Shut the fuck up. You know you're gonna lose that shit. No, Rexel's <laughs> gonna lose it faster than me, to be honest. Why you say that? <laughs> From what I heard, he told me he's been removed way too many And why right. do they keep giving it back to him, then? I'll never know. Well, that's all we have for our podcast here. Hope you guys had a good holiday. Fuck, no, don't end it. I'm going to Go end it. I'm going to end you're, it. You better, you're not fucking ending it. I'm dog. ending it. I'm ending it. Right now. You're not. I'm ending it in three, 